Pink House. That's it. Pink House. I, I got nothing else to say but me, myself, Pink House, man. Like, he, he was showed us so much love. And um, I mean, every chance he did uh, his, his annual parties, we were there. We offered us to perform up, up to the station interviews, mm -hmm. whatever we wanted played, played. And that would go from that range from him being at the college station all the way over to the transition to uh, G, like, uh, GCI, was it? 950 AM, 950 Because other than that, it was college radio. It was KKC, yeah, KKC DJ KKC, Chill at KKC, mm -hmm, HBK, and HBK, of course. That but was it. That was it. On the major side. And we've been to the seminars with, you know, Elroy and Elroy Smith and all of them guys and was like, hey, you get in your car going to work at 6 in the morning, you want to hear your song. You get in your car. So basically he's telling you we're going to play these same eight records <laughs> all day. But now when we go out of town, we in Virginia, we hearing, when the shit goes down, you better be ready. And Mary J. Blige, come on after that. Like, damn. Why everybody else could play everything mixed together, but Chicago, but Chicago is six records. You know what I'm saying? And I never understood that. Ramosi showed a lot of love, too. Yeah, yeah, Ramoski, Ramoski, yeah, yeah, Ramoski. I, you, you and Ramoski were real with, with cool too at one point. But I remember Ramoski used to show us love. Yeah, it, we did. We actually did. I can't yeah. complain about that. Actually, yeah. we did get. We got a lot more love than most Chicago artists did. Actually, from the radio. Yeah.